What is up guys, Catastrophic here, and welcome back to my channel, and today we're going to be going over NAMI. The Straw Hat Pirates Navigator NAMI, who absolutely sucks. I just noticed you get locks, oh greats down there for characters you use. Holy crap, I just noticed that. Wow. I'm stupid. Anyways, this character sucks. In my opinion, in my honest to goodness opinion, this character is absolute trash. And that's first impression, you know, for me. Like, I played a lot of games today with her. I feel like they were a lot of games. Um, uh, yeah, it was hard getting. It was hard to use. for me to use her in a way that really can show off what she can do. But the medals I got on her boosted her attack only. Um, I think that's a mistake on my part. I think it should be boosting her defense as high as I can. So she can tank attacks. But I didn't even have her level, nah, level 100 yet. <laughs> um, really need to work on that. I'm, I'm gonna come back to her in the future for sure. Is using her as level 100. We'll do another a follow-up video on it. But anyways, her attack sucks. Her defense is 1,069. I'm pretty sure that sucks. Yeah, it sucks. It sucks. <laughs> Everything sucks. Right, looking at her skills, she's got uh, Bella, uh, Bella Mirrors, Tangerines, Smash, and it gives a tech boost on the. Uh, uh, team boost. But Bell Bellamere's Tangerines. Mid range area effect that increases your allies' attack for attack by 10% for 30 seconds with a 59 second cooldown. And Smash, a close range uh, attack. Nullify Stagger for a short period of time. 280 skill attack, 23 seconds. They both suck. That's all there is to it. Both those skills suck. Her traits. Trait 1. When using skill 1, boost speed by 30% for 20 seconds. Does, cannot stack. Trait 2. When you capture the treasure, reduce your cooldown time of skill 1 by 30%. Both of these revolve around skill 1. You use skill 1, you get an attack boost, 10% attack boost, and you're getting a 30% speed bo boost. And then, you use skill 2, or your trait 2. Capture treasure, then it reduces cooldown time on this by 30%. Well, suck. That's all there is to it. This character sucks. Like, you compare it to, like, Usopp here. Usopp's skills are better. Or his traits, his skills are better. They do damage, then you have a, and they have additional effects. Those are good. His stats. Uh, not the best, but you know, and ignore the the stat boost here. These just random medals I have on them, but yeah, it's like the stats mediocre, but hey, mix up with it with his utility. When it, you know, and everyone knows what he does. Everyone knows. <laughs> well, I guess if you don't know, it's it's on the screen. You can read what it does, but he has utility. She doesn't. Like, you sure you can boost your teammate's speed, but, you know, so what? You're much better well, attack, boost your uh, teammate's attack. So what? There's better uh, characters that do the exact same thing, I think, if I'm not mistaken. No, I'm pretty sure she, uh, yeah. I think she boosts defense. As defense. But well, anyways. That's fine. But, you know, just plain old raising her attack. You know, it's a mediocre... It's a <sighs> I just didn't like this character. Like, don't even bother using her skill too. That's absolute trash. Don't use it. Okay? Don't. You know what? We're gonna get on right into the gameplay now. Before I keep rambling on. 
So, I started things out with uh, going with uh, Nami as a lead. See how that works. Some characters work better as leads, some don't. Oh yeah, I'll go ahead. I'll lead off with her. And my opponents have a really strong team. <laughs> they do, barring the Nami there. But anyways, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to head straight for D. And I'm going to take D. Right. And then, what I'm going to do with that, after that, as I'm going to zip around, I'm going to be following that storm. And while everyone's going to C, I'm going to be going to A. Capture A, because I... Like I said, after everyone gets, you know, the two points on their side, they always go for C, right in the center. So, I'm going to bypass all that fighting, and I'm going to go straight for for um, A. I get A. Here comes a crocodile. I'll go ahead. I use my skill one to get a speed boost, and he interrupts me before I can get attack boost. So, I got all kinds of people on me there, but thankfully, they died to the storm. I'm able to hold on to A a little longer. I decided to go for B. As I'm doing that, I got the Zoro right on my tail. So, he is being a problem. I can't fight him. Luffy's coming in to help. I'm still going for it. I get it. Then I'm getting out of the way. I'm pretty sure... Yeah, I use it. I use my skill. But I still die to Luffy. I plan on using the speed boost just to get out of there. But anyways, go ahead. I switch into my one point chopper, which I absolutely love this chopper. Can't wait to get him level 100. He's level 81 right now really love using him you know just like so fun just you run in and you start hitting things just like I'm doing there but yeah but unfortunately I get sandwiched here <laughs> yeah yeah the Inru and the Robin combined out I, I dropped so fast Anyways, it go allows me to go back in the Robin though so I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna use my uh, my skill one get my speed boost and my attack boost I'm gonna run I'm gonna charge in here I'm going to, we're going to get rid of this Luffy here. I get a kill. Get rid of this Luffy. We get that point. I'm going to be heading straight for right for point A, which was a bad idea because there's a Zoro uh, here. But I get knocked back by I, forget, I don't even remember. I think it now. I don't even know who it knocked me. But anyways, we won that game. Okay, that game ended with me last place in my team. So first off, shout out to Big and Loud, who's been a subscriber on this channel for a while, and I just so happen to have the pleasure of playing this game with him. So, anyways, he's on my team. He is running the Nami. I am running. I'm leading with Chopper, my arm point Chopper now, because I'm thinking I run. I'm going to try to run a Nami as a, a this a secondary unit. You know, just run her, uh, her after the Chopper. You know. Because I don't think she's a good lead. Kind of like Bonnie. Bonnie's not a good lead. I've still not even worked out how the frick to use Bonnie. But I'm running into the D. So my job here is more or less just to hit things. And I love that about the chopper. Because I can just run in and hit things. And here I am going toe to toe with this crocodile. And Luffy comes in. I uh, run around him. And I bap him right in the face. I love this chopper. Even at level 80. He's not at level 81, but at, even at level 80, he holds his own so well. And there I go ahead and I KO. I do believe I was the Mihawk I KO'd. But yeah, we got even more enemies coming here. And I'm taking this Luffy on again. And took out most of his health. This Mihawk ends up getting the better of me. Which is unfortunate, but I get to bring in Nami now. Now, I'm immediately going to you straight to point E. And I, I go there because I see my most enemies are uh, preoccupied with the center. Big and loud takes out the crocodile. So I go ahead and give him support. I give him an attack boost. I go back. I'm capturing D. And while I'm doing this, Big and loud is having some issues. He got. I'm pretty sure he gets KO'd down there. Yeah, he get, he's down there fine. He gets KO'd by the shanks. I think it was the shanks. I don't remember exactly. But anyways. I'm being an annoyer right here is all I'm doing. I'm just dodging and running, keeping them from getting spots. This Luffy thinks he's going to take it. I'm up there and hit him. Zoro comes after me. So I go ahead. I go and do, uh, I pop my, uh, my tangerines. So here, Big and Loud stuns all the enemies while I zoom, uh, zoom past. And I go straight for E. I got the speed boost, so I'm confident in how fast I'm going. This Zoro would have killed me had he not knocked me into that dish. Now I can survive all the punishment from them, and there's no way they get that point from us. It was a great game. Thank you for the support.
uh, that are big, uh, big loud, big and loud. Blah. So, all right. This game is on Saba Odi, so I'm going to the same strategy. I'm going to lead with uh, Chopper, and then bring uh, Nami in as backup. Sadly, I didn't use Nami as much in this game because my own stupidity, but yeah, it is what it is. Pwn's team is mostly blue and red. Anyways, I'm going to run right down, and first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to grab A, and then I'm going to jump over to the bubble, and I'm going to try to grab C, or fight for C, one or the other, because whatever, you know, YOLO, I try to hit the, and the enemy get out of the way, try to hit again, and you know, still didn't connect, so I go down here, and here's where I realized that this was a really laggy match, <laughs> and because of that, it makes things more difficult to, uh, difficult. So I'm just getting here. I'm building this uh, treasure gauge up. And I do have a couple of enemies come at me. I try to hit them. Nope. Uh, I missed twice with my skills. So I'm sitting there fine. But they get the team boost. I'm pretty sure that had it not been that far at team boost. You know. I would have stood a chance against them. But it is what it is. So anyways. I had to go ahead and spawn as Nami. And I drop down. Grab that treasure. Oh uh, that meat. I was going to run, but then here comes this Mihawk. So I'm going to sit there and I'm going to do stupid and try to defend this flag from this Mihawk, which I thought I could kill before he could hit me with that skill because I had the team boost, but I failed to do so. But I run in here and I get my revenge immediately. <laughs> I mean, immediately. <laughs> so yeah, then I go, I'm going to recapture B. And then. We, we got off a point, but I'm going to run back around to A to charge that back up so that no one can sneak down and capture it as easily. That's all I'm going to do in the rest of this game, really, is I'm going to be camping on A. Yeah. Yeah, it's like really unfortunate that Nami didn't get as much game playing here, but I played a lot of games. And <laughs> using her, most of them were not the best games. But, so I'm going to go ahead and just went with this footage anyways for the part of this video. But yeah, that Luffy tried to take that point by went ahead. Not one last minute KO. But thanks to this game though, though, that I got me a 5 star crocodile now. You know the routine. I'm gonna, uh, honestly, I thought about leading with Nami here because of all the blue on my opponent's team. But I decided not to. So I just go with Chopper. You yeah. know. There's like scarcely any red on that opposing team this time, but Chopper's solid lead here still. So, I'm gonna follow the same strategy I did last time. Pretty sure. Hmm. I'm gonna run down. I'm gonna go for. No, I'm gonna bypass A. Go for B this time. I'm catching B. And now I'm just gonna sit here. I'm gonna charge this up while everything is going on around me. You got enemies over there running around. They're going up for C. And no one's really paint, uh, trying to sneak down here yet. We got one uh, teammate on A charging up, and one, oh, well, he got me on B charging up. And as soon as I get this done, I'm charging in right over there for D, just like this. Now there's no one there, and I think, see, this is an opportune time to run over here. But unfortunately, that Moria went up to go after C, which saved me. Uh, in my attempts to capture D, but this crocodile jumps down here, so I had to take care of him really quick, and I got a team boost, so I was able to, you know, easily take care of him. I get D, and then here comes a Moria. I still got my team boost. There's a, sh a Mihawk shows up, and the team uh, Mihawk shows up, but we also got <laughs> an Azura who pops up here, so it's a big, it's a big mess, and, and I end up getting KO'd by the Moria. So what can you do? But here I get to switch into Nami. We're now down uh, a point, but I go ahead and get a KO on this crocodile. One of the few KOs I get with Nami. Yeah. So I'm going to run around. I'm going to jump up. I'm going to go for uh, C. I'm going to try to stop this Moria. But he runs away, so I go ahead and try to get me a attack boost. But the Zoro knocks me away, drops me on B. I still got my speed boost from my trait. So I'm going to run after D. You got a teammate on uh, E uh, trying to capture it. I try to capture D. Uh, Robin helps me, so we're able to get it. 
but we get knocked out of it, and the opponents are able to steal it back. But thankfully, our team was able to grab a different point, and I was able to kill the crocodile again. So that's the end of this video, guys. If you enjoyed, go ahead and leave a thumbs up down below, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video.